Dear friends, today's topic is what to do when your partner is getting angry on very small things. There are a lot of times there are issues in the starting. Everyone is so kind with each other, but as time passes, people try to stay calm, but they fail to stay calm because their real colors are coming up. In starting, they just want to impress each other. That is why they are pretending to be very cool and calm and suppressing their feelings and emotions, which are aggressive, because they are disliking what others are doing, but they are not doing anything. They are not saying anything or expressing anything, because they knew if they will express anything, people will dislike and then they can leave. So that is why in starting people pretend to be good, but over the period of time, they show their real personality, they show their real aggression, and when is the time when they show this kind of aggression? They show when they are sure that now you are not going to leave, and what makes them believe these things? When you start. to say please don't leave me you are important for me when you start saying these kind of words that i cannot leave you things like this then other person thinks that okay now this person is not going to leave me because this person is giving me some kind of assurance so now it's safe to express anger then people start showing their ex- aggression and they expect others to tolerate them and others tolerate that also because they are emotionally attached with that person and they are so emotionally insecure they were already emotionally insecure they had some kind of anxiety issues in their life that could be that can be social anxiety issues different emotional issues so due to those issues they were having difficult time the talking to people now they found someone with who they can talk easily now they have found someone with who they can express their emotions and that other person has understood the weakness now this person knows that she cannot leave me because she trusts me and that is the point where people start behaving so immature and so childish but what is the reason why do they behave the way they are behaving most of the time there are many factors involved few factors could be like someone is depressed in their own life they are frustrated they have mental issues their life is not going as they thought or they are having some difficult time in their family means their family is forcing them for doing something which they are not ready for example they want their uh, children to do some kind of courses study or any kind of uh, work which they are not interested so due to that also they feel not okay in their mind or there is the one major reason is there could be the attention thing they want attention they enjoy attention when they get angry you go to them you talk to them you make them feel special you make them feel important so they enjoy that thing they enjoy the pleasure that you are chasing them so just because of that they show a lot of aggression because more the aggression they are showing more you are giving them attention this is not really very mature way of doing these things obviously in relationship it's all about attention if someone is getting angry you should pacify other person pacify means 
you should make other person feel calm not angry because if you will not care then what relationship is this where you do not care what if someone is getting angry very rapidly very quickly frequently for no reason again and again and is not feeling okay means that person wants a lot of things from you means that wants that person wants a lot of attention from you he wants you to chase him a lot make him feel special when this is happening a lot then you should understand this is not the right person for you because it's good if someone is angry you should behave nice to that person that makes complete sense but if that person is becoming angry for no reason and frequently and showing no attention love and care towards you like it doesn't matter like your feelings don't matter why do you care about that person and do you think like this your relationship can exist no your relationship will become will become weak this is not how relationships are formed for relationship you should respect each other then you should trust each other these two are important things if you pretend to respect someone or if you pretend to trust someone then that is not a relationship and it is not going to stay for a long period of time so all i am saying is if your partner is losing patience very quickly and he is not even talking to you about that issue he is saying i am not interested i don't want to talk he is not clarifying anything but he is saying i am angry and i don't want to talk and you have no clue what to do you are becoming depressed you are going in depression and you are distracted from your life your goal your objectives in life this is not something good did you think that will be the future of your relationship obviously no you did not think that you want to suffer like this obviously you did not think that you will suffer like this and why to stay in a relationship if you are suffering like this and if other person is not interested in you at all you should ask this question to yourself why are you in this relationship when other person don't want you why are you forcing yourself on someone else when someone has no time for you so this is not something very good if someone does not give you the attention the way you give to them you should understand this person is giving his attention to someone else he is not giving attention that you should get so why you should give your attention to these people there is a problem with girls few girls love to fantasize about these kind of things and they think with time things will change i know few girls who are in this kind of toxic relationship since long time i can say since years they say their partner is good but he is confused he is not okay he needs time things will become okay sometimes when he is okay he gives time he talks so they have an expectation things will become good but what happens in real what is the practicality of the situation practicality is that this person is using you as a time pass you are just a time pass but you are in a denial mode you don't want to accept it 
but obviously you will accept it but what is the point if it's too late it will waste your precious time and you will lose a lot of opportunities what's the point after long time you will think what i have learned from this thing nothing i got an experience which is no use for me it wasted my precious time and energy i should have understood this thing long time back if someone left me i should respect their decision and i should leave them also why should i be with that person who doesn't want to be with me this is a simple question most people don't understand this thing they keep on fantasizing they keep themselves in some kind of illusion because illusion is beautiful than reality but they don't understand that illusion is illusion it's not a reality so all i am saying is try to understand if someone doesn't like you it's totally fine let them go some if you will let them go then some other person may come you are not letting anyone come in your life who 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 can be much better than this one or maybe you don't trust yourself maybe you don't maybe you do not think that you can get someone better so if you are not convinced yourself this is why you are not letting this person go who has already left you you are not the one who wants to believe this thing you should believe yourself you should understand the reality the sooner you will understand the reality sooner it will become easy for you to become stress free to feel the calmness to feel the peacefulness and you will realize that when you let someone go you create a space where new people can come thank you